Okay. Okay. Hey, Bob, it's Chris. Can you hear me? I can hear you. How you doing, buddy? I can hear you. How you doing, buddy? Doing good, man. Who you got? Chiefs or Eagles? Oh, I'm struggling right now. I got to be honest. I'm thinking my, my heart says I'd like to see the Eagles do it, but, but I honestly think the Chiefs are too tough to beat. That's, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe what are you I'm thinking? Wrong. Yeah. I don't, I, what are you I'm, thinking? I'm the same way, man. I, it seems like Eagles, 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 but Patrick Mahomes, Patrick Mahomes, man. I don't know. It's going to be, you know, Patrick Mahomes is like Tom Brady. Why would you root against, I mean, now why would you bet against that guy? I mean, yeah. All right, let's knock this thing out. Yeah. You got right, it. Here we go. Three, got one. It. Lots of us struggle with putting the love into Valentine's Day. Our next guest says if you create the right atmosphere, Cupid's arrow may land right where you want it to. Bob Giddy joins us now. He's a TV personality, and you may know him as one of the winners of The Bachelor and The Bachelor contestant. Hey, Bob, welcome back to Anthem Roadshow. It's great to see you. Yeah, great to see you again, too, man. Thank you so much for having me. All right, so look, a lot of us struggle with this, so that's why you're here. What are some simple yes. surprises that will delight our loved ones? Well, so this year I realized that my wife getting a present means everyone gets a present, right? So you can't forget about the kids on this one. So that's what I got going on here. And this Valentine's Day, send that special person in your life a beautifully curated floral arrangement. I love Teleflora. They're the world's leading floral delivery service. You can wow them with the Teleflora's Love Sparkles bouquet or the Teleflora's Charming Mosaic bouquet. But the thing I love about them the most, these bouquets are always made by hand and they are delivered to your doorstep by a local florist. So even though you got this big national presence with Teleflora, they're still keeping it local by making sure the local florists are involved in all the deliveries. You get a festive keepsake container, a nice vase that can be incorporated into your home decor for years to come. And all you got to do, you just log on to Teleflora.com to order and surprise your Valentine Day and you'll never go wrong with flowers. It's never going to go wrong. I agree with that, Bob. I mean, a lot of people say, don't give flowers, they die, whatever. But you know what? They're spectacular. And it really yeah. says that you really, yeah. that somebody means something to you when you give flowers. And those looked amazing. Thank you for that. Now, any yeah. gift ideas for that special yeah. someone in your life? Yeah, absolutely. We've got something this year that I think is great. If you're not, you know, maybe you've been together in a relationship for a long time and you love doing different things, adventure and things of that nature. Or even for the kids, we've got the Garmin Phoenix 7 Series Multi-Sport Smart Watches. Now, they combine the best features of fitness and outdoor watches, including wellness monitoring, superior navigation, built-in sports apps for running, biking, even pickleball, super responsive touchscreen. But best of all, you can solar charge them, freeing you up from, from having to plug them in every night. They're available in three sizes for men and women. They come in a variety of colors and bands. And then for the younger Valentine, and this is, I'm thinking, like, maybe they're, it could be they already have a cell phone, but maybe they're even too young for a cell phone. We've got it. Bounce is Garmin's first LTE-connected kids smartwatch. It features real-time location tracking, two-way text and voice messaging. So there you go. You got that dialed in. And then all the health and fitness features. So great gifts for the whole family right there. Definitely something that's a little bit out of the box and a little different. Um, but still really functional and fantastic to have. That's really cool, man. I love that. That's a great gift idea. That's something that everyone would like to get, especially the kids. But listen, you also want to make memories, and you want to yeah. have fun doing it, and you want to laugh, yeah. give the gift of laughter. Something tells me you got something for that. You know I do, man. Thank you so much for saying that. This is for the whole family, guys. This is the Disney trivia game. Everybody's got a favorite Disney movie. Everyone's got a favorite Disney character. This collectible game is recommended for ages six and up. It includes special cards just for kids, so even the youngest Disney fans can join in the fun. And then whether you are crowned the ultimate tri tri Disney trivia genius or not, this game will have every player reminiscing on the movies and characters that they love, like you said, making memories and just having a great time as a family. So I think we've got everybody covered. Covered. That's good. All right, Bob, so here's a question just between guys, okay? Yes, that sir. Somebody special in your life yes, says sir. something like, say, like, you know, don't get me anything. Just, you know, don't do it. That's kind of a trap, isn't it? Cause if it's you a total anything, trap. <laughs> Chris, you're so right, man. It's a total trap. I know. And my wife says it all the time. Well, let's not do presents this year. What that basically means is she's not getting me a present this year. If I show up without a present, I'm still in the doghouse. So I'm always like, oh, well, it's just a little bit of something, you know. Uh, yeah, I'd never take the bait on that one because I feel like you're setting yourself up for failure. I always show up with something. <laughs> got to have something. All right, you got anything else? And if not, where can people get more information? Yep, tons of stuff. You can find out everything we talked about today and even more on DailyLounge.com.
All right, Bob Guinea, it's great to see you, man. Happy Valentine's Day to you and to your family, and it's always a, a pleasure when you join us here on HRS. I love it, man. Thank you so much for having me. It's always great catching up with you guys as well. Have a great Valentine's Day, everybody.